Okay, so I think where we last left off, uh, the stream got cut off. It means uh, the videos on YouTube got cut. So this was after we sold uh, our like inventory and stuff to this uh, the shop owner here. Uh, this is before we go up and we talk to Vance and tell him about Ian. So we'll go ahead and do that right now. I don't think there was anything that I did... Um, previous to that because um, we can't get on that terminal otherwise people are going to see uh, I think we talked to everybody here I think I looked at everything um, yeah so let's go up and talk to Vance so hopefully you don't we don't have that issue Hello, again yeah. today but anyways we needed to talk to Vance uh, tell him about Ian's decision I expect that we're probably going to have to it kill these guys but uh, we'll just have to wait and see, so make sure I hard save it right here just in case anything happens. I don't think it will um, But yeah, I think we I think we'll be good. I think we should be good I hear that you decided to speak to Ian regardless of my warnings Be that as it may I am still interested in what you conversed about Did he come to a decision? Uh, Ian decided to leave the family we can talk about Arifu. Uh, how did you know Ian was trying to decide to stay or leave? My fine friend, that poor soul has been wrestling with the same question every new member of the family asks himself when they arrive. Do I belong here or should I depart? All I ask is that they spend the time to reflect before deciding in solitude. Um, I mean, we could say this option, but I know that by reading the computers, this isn't something that he wanted. He doesn't want, um, he only, he only wants them to pray when they're hungry or in self-defense, not just for the pleasure of doing it or, or whatever. So, um, you can't just pray, you can't just pray on them anytime you're hungry. What if I say that? I'm kind of I'm kind of curious. You wish to arrive at some sort of a bargain. Bargain. Oh wow. Give those people a chance. They're defenseless. Uh, medicine. Vampires can drink any kind of human blood, even from blood packs. I believe the blood preserved in blood packs could provide what you need. There must be an alternative source of blood you can survive on. Huh. Uh. Yeah, I guess we can say this. Sure. Curious. Many years ago, I survived by drinking from fresh blood packs I recovered from hospital ruins. The problem was that these oh, blood no. packs every blood are pack scarce. bring them here what do you propose oh no donates blood packs in exchange you protect them we'll sell you blood packs and you leave the town alone and you leave the town alone yeah i think they need to make some money too so but I don't remember there being a shop in there. I guess we'll say that one because this benefits Arifu. The fact that they get some si some sort of profit from it. Although I appreciate what you are trying to do, please realize that we have no money or goods to speak of. What little money Carl makes with his shop goes to buying weapons and ammunition to protect ourselves. I am very sorry. But perhaps you can make a better offer? Um, in exchange you protect them I don't think they want vampires protecting them we'll just say that we'll just say the first one I guess because I don't think they want vampires protecting them that's kind of probably eerie for them yeah agreed please Take this proposal to Arafu. Speak with them, and then return to me with their decision. 
I thank you for showing me that your kind can be trusted after all. It is a lesson I will not forget. Now, what of young Ian? Tell me his decision. This decision might screw up this particular quest, just saying. He may, he may not want to have blood packs after this. Uh, it's decided to leave. It saddens me to lose one of my flock, but I believe everyone has to follow their own path. All I was attempting to do was guide him. Now it seems that responsibility has fallen upon you. I hope you will be more successful. Oh no. Please. I want you to take this. Consider it as an apology to you for all the hardships you had to endure finding this place. Goodbye, human. Our time together has been rather educational. Shish kebab. Hello again. Do, 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 do. Okay. Um, do we still have that proposal? Do, do, it's Vance's proposal. Yeah, we still have that. Um, and the quest says, return to Evan King. Okay. Yeah, I... I mean, I really... I really didn't want to kill them. I mean, they're kind of cool. They're just doing their own thing down here. Um, but yeah, if we can uh, provide them with blood packs, then I think I think that's probably the better option. Because I just yeah, I just don't want to kill them. I just don't want to do it. Whoa, this guy here. Oh, it's you again. Yeah, I remember you. What's up? Uh, nothing. I would like to That's get on that, but reason. you know, it's it's kind of like if I would have killed all those people, then I could actually like looked at all that stuff. Um, I don't think there was anything in there. Oh, ouch! Uh, is it this way? Because I don't remember going out that way. Capital Waste. I remember going out this way. Huh. We'll go out this way and see where it takes us. I remember walking down here and um, seeing that it did go to the Capital Waste somewhere. So we'll figure out where it takes us. Uh, was it... Uh, yeah, I guess you gotta turn this way, I guess. Run! Yeah, when we originally came down here, all these, um... All those traps scared the crap out of me. Scared me so much. The tag skill. That might be something we get. Maybe we get the tag skill. Maybe we'll get that. I feel like the leveling up process has been going really slowly lately. But you know. I'm out of here. Where? Whoa. Whoa. Giant rad scorpion. Watch it. Hey, you better thank me. I just saved you. Help yourself to the water. You earned it. What water? Oh, over there. Wait a minute, bros. Come here. Help yourself to the water. You earned it. Sure. Yeah. So where the heck are we? The train yard. Oh. This is where we came in. This is where we went down underground. And we ended up over here by Agatha's. Interesting. Um, yeah, we'll just quick travel. Uh, probably should have looked around here first before doing that, but whatever. At least we know we can come back this way and reach uh, the family a little bit easier. Okay. 
So we gotta let him know about Ian. Uh, tell him about the proposal. I'm to see you. Thought you'd run for the hills. You run for the hills. There he is, the hero of the day. Uh, the family's been dealt with, and you owe me big. The family will never bother you again. Uh, I don't know about that. Yeah, I took care of your problem. We'll say that. I know. I talked to Ian, and he told me everything you did. I don't know how you did it, but goddamn, am I glad you walked up that ramp and lent us a hand. Thanks again, kid. Consider yourself welcome back here anytime you're in this part of the wastes. Three hundred experience. I like it. I have a proposal for you from Vance, the family's leader. Interesting. It seems they wish to enter into some kind of agreement. I guess it's better than pointing my gun down that ramp all day and hiding inside at night. Yeah. Let Vance know he's got a deal. We'll do it. I'll speak to the others. I'm sure they'll agree with me. All right. Um. No, nah, we don't need that. Come on back soon. I may have some stuff for you. Come on back soon. Um. Yeah, let's go ahead and wait. We'll go ahead and wait until it's day, and then we'll fast travel back to that uh, train yard looking place, and then look around outside before we go back down. Cool, so that quest is done. I imagine we might get maybe a little bit of XP from. From Vance from turning that in, but we'll have to wait and see. This is the first uh, time in, I think, two weeks since I've had tea. So, yeah. Oh, look, I'm gonna let's join these people in drinking some water. What do you say? Well, they're drinking Nuka Cola. Hello. Mm -mm -mm. Hey. All right, let's check over here. I gotta do that every time I drink tea because, um, the last time th that I went to the dentist earlier in the month, they had uh, saw a lot of staining from the tea. I guess, um, because I would drink it, you know, like the hour that I do now, which is like eleven o'clock my time. And I would go the entire day um, with just leaving it on there, I guess, like the, the residue from the tea. Um, so they recommended, like, if you drink some tea, then you uh, drink some water and swish with it afterwards. Uh, so every time I take a sip, I'm gonna, I am gonna I have to do that. Um, that way the, the tea residue doesn't stain my teeth. Too, too badly. Uh, what is he shooting at? Well, you killed it, whatever it was. Um, but yeah. That kind of sucks. And they're all like... Uh, they're like... Actually, tea stains... Uh, stains more than, uh, than coffee does. And I'm like... Really? That's insane. I would imagine it would be the other the other way around. Coffee would stain your teeth a lot. A lot more than tea would, but I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of weird. I don't drink coffee, so I wouldn't know. We have a lot of scrap metal, I think. How much scrap do we have? Let's see. Uh, 25. We have 25 pounds in just scrap metal. I can't wait to go back to Megaton and give it to the, to that guy. Okay, so this area is pretty clear. There's not a lot around here. Save it. Um, and 
we're going to go ahead and go inside here. I think there's two uh, entrances here. But we'll come down this one instead. Doo -doo -doo -doo. So, the plan right now is we gotta take this proposal to Vance, let him know hey, be more careful. everything should be good, um, and then from there I think we're gonna continue the big big trouble in Big Town. Uh, we gotta go rescue some, some uh, civilians from some super mutants in like a police station or something like that. So we'll go and do that. Um, but yeah, we're just going to continue on doing side questing and exploring, uh, and might do a little bit of some DLC. It just depends on how much we get done. Um, we'll hold off on the main story for quite some time. There's a lot we still need to do, Thanks again for straightening out. it'll be, um, it'll be side questing stuff, which is going to be interesting. I guess Vance just sits up here all day. Well, well, look who's back. All right, Vance, come here, bro. Always a pleasure to receive you in Moresti. Moresti. What brings you down here today? Moresti, Romania. Uh, can you teach me the ways of the vampire? No. Uh-uh. I am not going to be drinking blood. Uh. Hang on one second. I want to see what this does. Let's save Always it. Always a pleasure to receive. To be a vampire is a life commitment. I want to it see what this hap what happens here. Words. It is something you earn <clears throat> by your own will and sincere meditation. Sadly, I cannot fully make you one of us, but I can teach you how the lifeblood of others brings us regenerative powers. Since your body lacks the way to extract blood as we do, you must find alternative sources for your nourishment. Blood pack. Deep of the blood, allow not a drop to spill. Feel the warmth as it spreads inside you. You are becoming one with the life force of another. They lend a part of themselves to you. For a brief moment, you are two entities becoming one. Allow the feelings to course through your body as you partake of the blood. Feel it empower you and make you stronger. Once you have done this deed, only then will you know what it is like to be a vampire. Vance's teaching have uh, granted you the ability to regain 20 HP from the consumption of blood packs. Hey! Uh, I'll go ahead and take that. That's totally fine with me. Because blood packs right now, if you pick them up, they only heal you by one HP, so that might be a reason to keep blood packs now, yeah. Excellent. Okay. I knew you would serve as an ambassador for us in good faith. Your efforts surpass those of the average human. In fact, I feel almost like you are a member of our flock. If you ever wish to learn our ways, you have but to ask. Already did, bro. Uh, how are things going now? Very well, actually. Our truce with Arafu is coming to fruition. I've begun teaching my people to live off of the donated blood packs. The transition has been difficult, but we will manage. Good. You've certainly done us a great service, and I can't thank you enough. Well, hey, all right. I'm certain our paths will cross again. At least we didn't have to kill the vampires. Um... Let's take a look at the perk again. It was this one. <laughs> the Vault Boy in Vampire Attire. It's even got fangs, too. That looks really cool. Perk allows you to regain health by consuming blood packs. I think we have blood packs, do we? No, we do not. Okay. Um, 
So the next thing that we need to do is uh, rescue the, the big town captives from the super mutants. So we'll go and do that. Go ahead and head back out. I knew you'd get the hang Make our way over there. Good job, Alan. Well, see you around, I guess. Real quick, how is our um, how is our power armor doing? Oh wow, look at that! Yeah. Like I really, I really wish you could just repair your your items without having to have a duplicate. Needed a place to get out of the sun for a while. Like being able just to repair when your repair skill is at a hundred would be lovely. The fact that I have to find another power armor suit and you know uh, repair mine using that, that kind of sucks. I mean I guess I could always pay somebody to do it but then it's like Wait a minute, if I'm paying somebody to repair uh, an item for me, why can't I just do that on my own? Hmm. Alright, um. Anyways, this thing is up this way. Actually, it's actually this way. So we'll just go ahead and walk there. Go ahead and hard save it. So vampires are done, which is good. But we'll go ahead and walk our way there to uh, the German Germantown police station or something is what it's called. We'll see if anything comes along the, the way. One bottle cap. Yep, totally worth it. Because I know that there's still a lot of things that we haven't seen in terms of like uh, like side quests and um, like discovering towns and, and little places like that whoa uh, I don't need any other meat or anything um what way do I want to go Germantown Police HQ. Yeah, I think we'll just follow the uh, the road here. Let's go ahead and do that. Follow thy road. 30 minutes in and so far we're good. So far we are good. I think it's this way. This place looks like there's definitely like a town or something here, so there's probably going to be a bunch of uh, locations there. God, look at that cluster of locations. Like, man. Holy crap. Hmm. Well, there's going to be a lot of super mutants around, so we're going to have to deal with that. Uh, these houses look like there's nothing in there, so I'm not even going to check. It would be a lot easier if we just had, like, a car or some sort of vehicle to just drive around in the waste instead of going on foot. Germantown Police Headquarters. Dang, this place is, like, stacked. It's all barricaded and everything. Over here. Ooh, look at that sign. Germantown Police Headquarters. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Alright. Go inside and kill some super mutants. Oh, blood trail. Yeah, like, man, look at all these sandbags and fences, and they got a maze going on here. Be aware of the 
They're not doing a very good job of this is supposed to be like, uh, you know, like their base and their, there's nobody out here on, like, for defense purposes. Uh, the computer's just shattered. Put this away. Hey, a terminal that works. Save it. Um, Nancy Croden. I would imagine log entry one is something we were going to do. We were mobilized in the early evening. Security clearance isn't high enough to know that... Uh, to know this on an official level, but I have it on good authority that we're under the threat of a Chinese attack. Oh, this is back, uh, back, way back when. Okay. Uh, do I really want to read all this? More bombs? What's happening? Three... Drove all night from Pennsylvania. We're doing our best to keep the survivors, uh, they sated. Ow. <laughs> um. Looting gets worse every day, and it's a small town. Um. Blah, blah, blah. Was that three, or was that four? Sort of the deserted in the night. Uh, mm -hmm -hmm. Seeking refuge in a nearby vault. Is there a vault around here? It could have been vault um, 92 or whatever it was. Aegis. Days I feel like more of a preacher than a nurse. Um, without medication, the people are succumbing to radiation sickness, for which there is no hope of treatment. Uh, when the painkillers and whiskey run out, there will be all we can to offer. Wow. I suppose it seems only right to say goodbye. I ought to know it's hopeless, but maybe one of my sisters is still out there. And I couldn't go without leaving some kind of farewell. Just to know that I did everything I could. I tried. I only wish that I could be the last one to go. So I could have helped all the others before they met their own head. Wow. So. Pretty much they managed to survive. Uh, the attack. And. Everyone pretty much slowly died. Um, due to radiation sickness, which they had no way to cure, which sucks. You survived the war and all that, and then only to die by something simple as radiation. Man, every time I'm coming out, I'm walking into your body. Yeah, I know you are. So was that... Oh my god, dude. You have to step... You don't need to be that close to me. Okay, so that, that that is the entrance that we have to go. We have to go that way. What are you doing, you weird AI? What? There's bombs going off. There's some stuff going on in there. Uh, I guess we're going in. Ground floor locked hard. Wow. Uh, yep. You gotta be precise. Gotta go down just a little bit more. 